you know, what is the, the role of time, the illusion of time, and so on in the reality of our lives. I, I think that the, uh, let us say, uh, clairvoyance as classical parapsychology, this paranormal experience of uh, clairvoyance uh, suggests that the past, the present, and the future are interconnected in some way that is beyond uh, evolution, and it is beyond the platonic model, and and so on. So non-locality and uh, non-temporality, if we can understand this aspect of, of ordinary reality, then we have to have a different uh, theory about how we decide what to do in life. And in order to be in harmony with that kind of universe as it exists, we would, uh, I think, have to proceed more by intuition, which is in tune with that, as opposed by uh, mentation, rational thought, and so on, according to physics and the like, which uh, physics says the future is not determined. The past is completely different from the future. There's the collapse of the wave function or something that happens through mysterious process of observation. And uh, <clears throat> in that model, it um, matters very much what you do to create the future. If there is uh, the future already has, let us say, a spectrum of possibilities with different probability measures that are changed by our mentation and so on. And uh, uh, I, I think in that, in that paradigm, we would have to give a higher priority to the arts, to intuitive workers and to the like the Sufi idea of love, that that kind of uh, thing that if you are in harmony in some sense with the world as it wishes to be, then you're a better person in terms of you know this uh, non-temporal morality.